Okay. Um, so for this problem, uh, we know that we can simplify by using difference of two squares as long as I have an equation that's in the form of a squared minus b squared. If it is, then I can factor it really, really quickly into that, right? A, a minus b, a plus b. So I look at this problem and I say, all right, do I have an a squared? Can I write 20 as a squared number? Yeah. No. Can I write q? That's, is it q cubed? It's squared, right? That's what I thought. I can write q squared though, and I can, but I can't write 5 as a squared number, but I can write r. So before you just say, oh, stop, it's prime, the first thing, the first rule of factoring always is to look to factor out a g c f, a greatest common factor. And can I factor something out between 20q squared minus 5 r squared? Five. Five. Now, can I write this as a difference of two squares? Yes, I can write this as 5 times 2q squared minus r squared. <coughs> because 4, you can write as 2 squared, and then she can just put them in there. Because is 2q squared the same thing as 4q squared? Yes, it is. Now, sorry, now that's frenzy. Now, I can just factor this. So it would be 5 times 2q plus r times 2q 